Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today we do have an exciting video. Today is a group order sorting video, obviously, as you can tell. I do have 60 Yukika albums here in front of me, and I am so excited. I did count all of these albums just to make sure that I was not missing any. So they did give us 30 of the Time Light and 30 of the Time Blue version. So perfectly split right down the middle. I am so excited about that. I do have my signed album right here in front of me. I do have it off frame and I'm not looking at it. Um, so I'm very excited about that. I'll show you guys that in a little bit. And then we have all of the Hanteo chart verification things. So I'm gonna be giving these to all of my group order enterers. So hopefully they will verify their albums. Um, I haven't counted the pre-order sets or the photo card sets yet. So hopefully we should have 60. So these came with if you ordered a set of two albums. So I should have 30 sets of these, I believe. If I did my math correctly, 60 divided by two is 30. So we'll go through these first and count them. So, so far my music taste hasn't messed up anything yet, which I'm very excited about. This is my first time purchasing from my music taste for like a group order or a fan sign. So luckily so far nothing has gone wrong. So I wanna show you guys the fan sign photo cards just up close. So this is the first one. I think this is my favorite one. It's just so pretty. Secondly, we have this one. And then finally we do have this one. Oh, and here is the back of the card if anyone wanted to see. It does say my music taste on the bottom. And then we're gonna go ahead and count all of these just to make sure that we have all of the sets. One, two, twenty-nine, and thirty. So Yay! Nothing was messed up, so we do have everything that we need. And then before we start sorting, I'm gonna go ahead and take out some albums. Some people did request that theirs were sealed, and then we'll go ahead and start sorting for uh, the cards and stuff like that. <laughs> okay, everyone, luckily my music taste did give me all of the fan sign photo cards and all of the pre-order postcard sets. So I did take out all of the albums that people wanted to be sealed and we're just gonna go ahead and start sorting albums. But yeah, so we're gonna go through, pull out all the photo cards and stuff. Also gonna kind of look through cause there is a possibility of pulling a Polaroid. So really hoping that I get one. So we're gonna start out with the time blue version. Uh, this version is really pretty. Also, it's just the closest one to me. So we're just gonna start out opening these ones and then we'll move into the time light ones a little bit later.
So as expected, I did not pull a Polaroid in any of the Time Blue versions and I am losing my mind, my sanity, everything. Uh, I'm gonna freak out. <sighs> but anyway, so let's go ahead and show you all the inclusions that we did pull. So I already counted this stack, so we pulled 12 of this photo card. We pulled 10 of this photo card, this really cute one. And then I think we pulled the most of this pink photo card. We pulled 15 of this pink photo card. This one is probably my favorite of the set. And then finally, And then we pulled 11 of this photo card as well. For the film strips though, we pulled, we pulled 14 of this version and we pulled 10 of the laying down version. So overall, those were our pulls for the time blue version. Let's go ahead and move on to the time light version. Okay, so we are going to go through the time light version, but yeah, so let's go ahead and go through these albums. Please, can we manifest a Polaroid in this album? Please. And then also this version does have my signed album, so I will show this at the end. Why is this card stuck? Hello? Um, hello? Oh, it's cause a sticker fell off the sticker sheet. Are you kidding me?
Okay, everyone, so this is the last sealed album that I have to open of the albums that I am opening. After this, I will go ahead and show you my fansign album. So far, I have not pulled a single Polaroid, but it's fine. It's fine. Um, so we're just gonna open this. Let's manifest right now that there's a Polaroid in here. Literally checking behind the CDs too. All right, so we're gonna go through the inclusions and see how many of each photo card we pulled did not pull a Polaroid in the final album. I'm gonna go through the inclusions and then we'll show my fansign album at the end. 11 of this photo card. And 12 of the brown haired Yukika photo card. Seven of this photo card. I feel like we pulled the most of this one. And 18 of this photo card. And then for the film strips, we pulled 10, 10 of this style, 14 of this style of the film strip. Okay, so now that we have that out of the way, we can go ahead and look through my fan sign album. All right, so this is the My Music Taste fan sign album. Um, they did put it in a plastic sleeve, which I am very grateful for, but I am going to open the sleeve and probably put it in one of my own, just because I don't know if it's PVC free and I also want to check my polls in this album. Okay, so first of all, we're going to go ahead and turn it around and look at what she she actually uh, signed to me. So let's go. Okay, so here is my um, fan sign album. It's so cute. It looks like her marker was like running out of ink a little bit, but that's okay. Okay, so here it is without all of the like stickers and stuff on it but yeah so here it is it's so cute i love how shiny this album is but let's go ahead and open it i am seriously doubting that we pulled the polaroid uh it's not a polaroid it's not a polaroid mm. okay interesting okay so here were the um other photo card inclusions in my signed album and this one moment of truth y'all let's look one more time All right, everyone, since there are so many albums, I really don't wanna do like an ending shot with all of the albums spread out on the table. Also, I'm feeling a little bit upset that I didn't pull a Polaroid in any of these albums. So it's okay though, I still got a signed album out of it and it's so cute and I have the memories to show for it. I'm gonna be keeping an eye out um, for any Polaroids that end up going for sale, but just in case. But yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry if this video was a little bit boring, but uh, yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.